In this video, we will talk about radial density, CAT scans, or computer axial tomography, uses computer process x-rays to produce tomographic images or slices of specific areas of the body. Different tissues have different radial densities. Bone, which we see right here, is very dense and blocks most of the x-rays from the scanner. Therefore, it appears white. Blood in the middle of the thoracic aorta does not block many x-rays and therefore it, the blood appears dark. Radial density is measured at the tip of the cursor. This number is seen over on the middle of the left edge of the screen. Where my pointer is pointing now, it has a radial density of 282. The units for this measure is Hounsfield units. Thus, bone at this point has 282 Hounsfield units. The standard for Hounsfield is water, which equals zero HU units. Air has a negative 1,000 HU units. This table shows the radial density of different tissues. Thus, you can see that lung has a radial density of negative 500. Um, kidney has a radial density of around 30. Blood somewhere between 30 and 45. Capex has a tool called windowing that adjusts the digital image to optimize the viewing of bone and different soft tissues such as brain, lung, and organs in the abdomen. Thus, in this image, the intervertebral disc looks very homogeneous. However, in the same slice, by adjusting windowing, we can make out the outer annulus fibrosis and the center nucleus pulposus. In the next tutorial, we will discuss the windowing tool.